Have you seen this man before? Oh, most certainly. Was here only yesterday. Here? Yesterday? My God, he's close. Yes, he was asking a lot of questions, just like you. What did he ask about? He asked about American called Stoby. Stobart? Yes, Stobart. You know him. The killer knew my name. What else did he ask about? He asked about a German man called Klobner. I tried to remember the name of the man the conspiracy had lost in Syria. Was his name Klausner? Sure, that is what Voltar said. Klausner. I told this man in the picture, Klausner wanted to go up to Bull's head. Hold on, he wanted to go where? Bull's head. Big hill, ten mile out of town. Maybe sixty. When was that? Oh, maybe a week ago. What can you tell me about this Bull's Head Hill? It's most magnificent, lovely views. Worth visiting, yes, by indeedity. How do I get there? No, let me guess. You need fine luxury guide to take you there in air-conditioned taxi. Woe is me, where can I find such a guide? And Ultar is most luxurious guide for most literally some way, in any direction. Gee willikers, lucky old me. Are you desirous of my pleasant and luxuriant service? All right, let's go. First, I regret the formalities. A trip to the bull's head. Fifty Yankee dollars, please. Fifty bucks? I don't have fifty bucks. Oh, most unhappy event. Ultar then sorry, but he cannot take you on ride of lifetime. Hold on, Ultar. Is there nothing I could barter with you? Word that it was so, beloved friend. But my taxi needs gas, and its muffler needs the muffler doctor. Trading for these things is not possible. My heart weeps for the injustice, but it's box or zip. Oh, unfortunate American. About both. Are you desired? Well, a terrific fifth. Well, I. Oh, the. De See you around, Ultar. Fare you most splendid, good sir. Damn, the door's locked. Uh, I'm sorry? Did, did you say something? He say you not to go in toilet. Read sign, matey. Matey? It lose something in translation. By staring hard at the notice and squinting, I discovered I couldn't understand a word of it. Hello again, Ultar. Praise be to Allah. I am blessed with your bountiful presence once more. Could you tell me what that sign means? It's a door stay shut until brush come back. Signed, the management. Oh, well, what does that mean? Manager buy lovely new toilet brush, leaves it by wash basin for 10 minutes, come back, it's been stealing, stolen. Not even out of wrapper. He damn cross, lock up toilet and say, nobody use fine pristine toilet until brush given back. We say, what we do till then, eh? He say, cross legs and your superior willpower. And that's what you've been doing? No. Ultar use bucket. Bye for now, Ultar. May good fortune follow you, mister. Hi. Nice club you've got here. 
I was wondering if you could help me. What? I mean, I beg your pardon? I'm sorry, but I don't understand. No surprise there, all righty. He says sorry, but he not speak English. Uh, but he didn't say anything. He not have tongue. No tongue? What happened? It was bet. Ah, and he lost. He won. You should see other chappy. Oh, yes. Hi, Nijo. Hello again, sir. And how may I help you this time? What do you know about that couple? Oh, they're American. Is that all? The chap's a little odd. As for the lady, it's a funny thing. But I get the impression she's a lot cleverer than she's letting on. I met an interesting guy earlier, a cab driver. Ah, that would have to be Uttar. A barbaric sort of chap. Oh, he's not that bad. You know how he speaks in Pidgin English? That's how he speaks in Arabic, too. Who's the guy selling the kebabs? Oh, that's Arto. A miserable blighter, to be sure, sir. He doesn't seem very happy. He never is. Day in, day out, a face like a wet Wednesday. Whatever one of those is. Does he speak any English? Not cogently, no. See you around, Nijo. Ta-ta for now, sir. Hello again, Pearl. Why, hello, George. It's such a pleasure to see you again. Have you ever heard of a hill called the Bull's Head? No. No, I haven't. Is it nearby? I'm not sure. Sounds awful romantic. The Bull's Head Hill. Have you met the taxi man, Ultar? Havens, yes. What a big man. Very muscular. But you didn't go for a ride. Why, George, you're absolutely the most... 
Oh, you mean a taxi ride? No, Dwayne wasn't interested, so it didn't happen. I've got to go now, Pearl. It's been a pleasure, George. Don't be a stranger. <laughs>